What up, YouTube? It's Mr. The Man Diamond, them squares. Coming live and direct, the look style. Backing up off the compound. Whipping it like I always do. Head to the shop. Like I always do. So like my life is on repeat. You know we gotta get it done because the weather is rapidly changing. And you know how y'all get out there. Y'all get in y'all feelings when the weather change. Y'all get all emotional. My car ain't gonna be done. I'm gonna get my car finished. <laughs> oh, I ain't never been knowing so many grown ass men be crying about this damn car shit. But I guess if you from the Midwest, you know we only got a couple, like three months of warm weather. My, my uh, customers from uh, from the West Coast and, and where it's hot at, South. All year round, they don't be tripping too much. It's the Midwest people that be, man, my car, man. I got an appointment with the painter. <laughs> it's gonna be all right, man. It's gonna be all right. Anyway, yeah, we head to the shop. Uh, I'm thinking about doing a collab, collaboration from other YouTubers. Uh, I'm trying to get connected with uh, either Sprayway Customs. I got three options. Sprayway Customs. Uh, what's the other one? Uh, uh, True Grit Customs. Hold on a minute. Oh, this is the craziest shit ever. This man just pulled me over. Let me show y'all. Is that car right there? He just pulled me over. I bought some seats because he seen my sign on the side of my truck. And he stopped traffic and pulled me over. And then some people got out, thought I was harassing him and asked me what the hell I was doing looking in this truck. <laughs> Boy, I almost got a racial profile. <laughs> the shit that goes on around here. So, as I'm making my video vlogging, as I do, uh, the car, the guy in front of me just stopped his truck in the middle of the road. I'm like, dang. So I'm talking to y'all on the camera. He get out the truck like, man, I see your sign on your truck. You do interior? I'm like, yeah. So I stopped the camera, you know, when I stopped it. So he said, I don't give a shit. I know all these police officers around here. I've been here 75 years. <laughs> he said, we can talk in the middle of the street. <laughs> so we talking it. And then about four cars pull up. Like, is there any problem? They thinking I'm harassing him when he asking me about doing his damn seats. Ain't that crazy? So, they like, oh, we just making sure that everything's okay over here. Like, what the fuck? So I guess they was gonna um, try to put the paws on me. But I wasn't having, you know, I'm strapped to death. And I'm, I'm uh, they call it around here, uh, stand my ground. <laughs> Well, it was all good. Y'all almost seen a, uh, a homicide on camera. But we back on the road to the shop. And like I was saying, before I was rudely interrupted, uh, I want to do a uh, collaboration with Sprayway Customs, True Greek Customs, or uh, 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 my man in Chicago. Uh, uh, what the hell is his name? Uh, not MB. MB too booked, booked up. Uh, the other one, the do paint jobs. Tweet G, Tweet G. Actually, I got cars for each one of them. Um, I spread my cars across America just to get them done. Um, and my man up in uh in Texas do the LS swaps. Illuminati. I call him Illuminati. <laughs> That's my man, Illuminati. Up in Texas, I need one of them LS swaps, man. So, hopefully, before the springtime hit real good or summertime, we'll be doing collab. I'm gonna do a collaboration with them and we can get some new content going because I think we put out some major hits. With my man, the LS swaps and them paint jobs, them boys be putting out, boy. One of my interior jobs, we, can, we might uh, we might have a something here, we might have something very interesting. So. Y'all need to go follow them guys on YouTube, check them out, and tell them they need to do a collab with me. You know, because 
y'all need some collaboration. We need to stop everybody competing on YouTube and shit. We need to start working together and start uh, keeping this money circulating between us and everything will be all good. But back to the topic. I'm headed back to the shop. Uh, I got to go grab some tools because I got to go take some seats out of a, a, a challenger. Uh, 2015, 16 challenger. You want some red guts. So I'm going to get my tools so I can go ahead and grab that out of there. And um, we're going to get into some shop shit later on. So stay tuned, y'all. We just pulled up to the customer house and we're going to um, look at this challenger. I'm about to take the seats out of here so I can do a quick seat flip. You know, I do new cars too sometimes. So I'm going to do a quick seat flip. Um, show y'all what you got working with. So here you go. Got the Challenger. Got the red pipe, red levels on the tire. This is what we're working with, y'all. I told him to leave the car in the middle of the garage. He sleep. He just got off work early this morning, so he sleep. He just left the garage door open. But he got the young Gucci in there. Gucci pillows. You see what it is? Ugh. Well, I can't move that one. But let me show y'all something that's amazing. That I haven't seen this in a long time. Y'all know what that is, right? got the Lambo. Yeah, we in the we in the, we in the south, y'all. We in the south. So I know y'all see a lot of stuff. Got the young Moet bottle. He turning up in here. Yeah. Y'all see what is going on. So let me see if I can get these seats out of here with these damn Lamborghini doors. You know, that's going to be hard. I'm about to put the tax on them. Plus, I'm going to curbside service oh yeah I gotta put the tax down so looking at the back seat it will have a stupid ass bolt like that and I don't even think I got the socket for that here with me both sides then the door look how much room I got to get the seat out I need to call big Mike so he can tear the door off then I gotta get up under the front he got the diamond the diamond mats so I'm going to have to try to squeeze in here and do this, man. One problem after another. Jeez. Drastic times calls for drastic measures. So this is what my tool bag look like inside of here. Sawdust and everything. But look what I found. I found it. Yeah. I know I had one somewhere. Special tool for the special stupid ass seats. I hate them, them bolts more than I hate super tweeters. Let's see if it's going to work. Ugh. Yes, sir. There we go. There we go. It's on there. Okay. I gotta clean this shit up. When you're used to working by yourself, this is what you gotta do. Since the door won't stay up, I have to make a prop. So, I took a trope, a tote, and a basketball, and I propped the door up. <laughs> shit. You gotta do what you gotta do to get this sh money. So, <clears throat> hopefully I'll be able to recline the seat back and squeeze it off this little hole right here. But this is what happens when you don't have no help and Big Mike is not around for reinforcements. So, you got to do what you got to do. So, I'm about to attempt to get this door through this crack. Pray for me, y'all, because it might be ugly. Pray for me. Pray for me. <clears throat> so, I have to turn it down and squeeze it through the hole. That's one out, y'all. I think I'm only going to take the front the passenger out. And then let's take the... Take the back seat up out of here and get the rest later. He needs to have that seat so he can move the car. But I got one out. Mission accomplished. It's deluxe. Woo wee. So I got the bottom seat out. You see, we got the Gucci pillows right here. These are some dope pillows. So I think I'm going to keep the color similar to this right here. This reddish burgundy brick color. That way we can make everything match. You still can use some of this, these pillows. Um, so, but looking at this, we got amps and shit on the back of the seat, so I got to unscrew this shit. I do not want to take this shit apart, so hopefully I'll be able to screw this shit and um, weave the wire through the holes in the back. <clears throat> See, so I'm actually, I might just have to, uh, 
this little thing right here might just have to get cut right here. Because I'm not going to take this shit apart. I might just split it at the seam right here and cut it out. Because I'm not going to take all that shit apart, man. It's, it's too much. And I'm not getting paid to hook up stereo systems or shit. So it's better for me to just cut that shit. So, more problems, more problems, more problems. That's why they call this a motherfucking challenger. Because it's a challenge to put this bitch together. Back on this shit, y'all. So we got them off. So I'll set them back there. Out the way. Put some light on the subject. Now I just got to take them two bolts right there. One right there. Uh, and them two over there. Three quarter inch. Socket. And this back seat top will come out. That's all I need for this one. Come back and get the headliner later. And we're going to figure out something with the door. Put, I probably put an insert in that door right there. So, so let me get on this again. I'm tired, man. I'm tired. Skinny man problems. And it's out of here. It took me exactly an hour to strip this car. Well, to take this stuff out because I couldn't find the pieces and whatnot. Seats are right there. I'm still squeezing out this little bitty ass hole. <laughs> With that Afro engineering technique right there. Yeah. Yeah, that's what messed the real meaning of balling. You feel me? All right, so now I'm going to get up out of here. I ain't going to wake him up and tell him I'm leaving. I'm just, just going to get up out of here. Load my shit up in my truck. Ugh. Oh, boy. See, see the truck right there. Load him up in the truck. Ugh. Try to do this with one hand. Oh, man. Ugh. See the fresh suede. Anybody want some red suede seats? Nobody never sat in the back. You know me. I sell these motherfuckers. Clean them up. Somebody got a challenge. You need some of this. I get the old raggedy guts out of challenge. But. Uh. <sighs> See nice neighbors. Nice neighborhood. Hood things and nice neighborhoods. So. About to wrap this up, y'all. So, first part of the day, deluxe shop life. We go anywhere, anytime, any place. Two bag, tools, truck, deluxe. I'll.